This gathering conveyed by the Universal Health Coverage Forum is to make presentations on where Nigerian is and ways of reducing or eliminating it. The executive director, NPHCDA, in his submission, laments high rates of maternal mortality, saying Nigerian has the highest burden in the world as he calls for a drastic action. We have outcomes in healthcare that are not acceptable. Somebody put on here maternal mortality rates. But that's true if you talk about infant, if you talk about child, if you talk about... And that's, that correlates very well with the fact that coverage of the basic services that we need, antenatal care, immunization coverage, malaria prevention and treatment, HIV screening, TB treatment, all of those are far in terms of their reach and coverage. In their submission, the co-chair UHC Forum and the Regional Director Operations outlined the importance of conducting policy analyses to guide informed decision-making on the local government area's autonomy and its impact on primary health care. They maintain that the need for NPHCDA to involve civil society in discussions is key. We've done high-level stakeholders meeting and it came out clearly that when we are talking about putting health on the political front burner, we have to be very, very clear what exactly in health are you putting on political front burner. That was what gave rise to the citizen-led health agenda that we actually uh, developed ahead of the 2023 election. Maternal mortality and infant mortality hits individuals, each person and multi people, each one at a time. And so, we, we need to give power to all stakeholders. We need to create that space where every stakeholder will really have that conversation to also harvest that energies that is resident amongst all the stakeholders. Comfort Idoko, ITV News.